Hey guys, thank you so much for tuning in. I know you're probably wondering what uh, the fashion challenge is, so we're just going to jump right on into it. So um, I'm today I'm just going to take a little bit of time to give you a little bit of a challenge. I want to challenge everything that you thought you knew about fashion. And, and here's why. So recently, uh, after posting a couple of different things, I've noticed that I've gotten conflicting responses. Um, just everything from, you know, how you should dress a body type or just what's trending. And so I kind of want to touch briefly on that. So as it, it, it may come to a shock to you guys that um, we're all going to think different thoughts. And, and as fashion has evolved um, with humanity, uh, a lot of things have changed. So when we hit that stage of enlightenment, which meant that we started to develop our own ideas and started to figure figure out what was pleasing to us, uh, everything about fashion literally changed for each and every one of us. So I want to challenge you guys. I want to know how many of you guys sit in front of the TV or the computer and research every single fashion show there is. I'll wait. I bet if I said 1%, that would be way too much. I mean, when I look at fashion shows, I'm looking for something that specifically speaks to me. Um, I'm not looking for something that speaks to the whole world. I'm looking for what I like about that specific garment. And so when we come back with trends and, and uh, you know, just how to how to do certain things it's going to be completely different than the next person and that's okay because fashion is supposed to be unique to you specifically so I can tell you what I like about fashion and I can tell you how I would dress something or style um, and I can even tell you what body type you are but if you feel differently I mean that's your right you have that right to do that not one person will ever think alike and I also have another question do you think that uh, the the fashion industry really like talks to each other and they say hey Tommy what are you gonna are you know do you do you like that zigzag pattern you wanna you wanna kind of collab on that so it will be a trend and Tommy's gonna say no Balmain I want to go ahead and I want to do something sheer let's do sheer that doesn't happen it just it's research that they do they figure out what's most popular, uh, what, you know, us as consumers, they're researching us constantly to figure out what we like. And then they base their collection off of maybe a tree or, you know, like stuff is just different. So yeah, sometimes things will kind of like fall in place and Tommy Hilfiger will have the same thing as Balmain and maybe they've used the same type of fabric. Maybe, maybe they like sparkles this season and so both of them have a sparkly dress and we can say that's trending, but what's really trending is what you think is trending. Um, as a consumer, you're, you're going to buy a product based upon what you like. And so you do the research and figure out like what specifically you like about this specific garment. Um, and so I, I want to just challenge you guys today to kind of think outside the box and to be okay. Fashion is meant to uh, be unique to yourself. You're supposed to be a unique individual. If everybody in the entire world dressed alike, it would be pretty boring. And so that's the reason why you have this creative uh, ability to really just get out there and do whatever it is that you want. So as we as we move into these next couple of months, just really with like trends, and I'm super excited, guys. You have absolutely no idea how I, how excited I am with trends and shows and things that we're going to be doing. I want you guys to to keep an open mind. Um, just because you know you don't think it might be trending, I mean, do a little bit of research. Maybe it's trending over in this specific area, or maybe over here they're doing this. I mean, the world is such a big place. It's it's so hard when you want to keep yourself in a box. It, you, it, you don't see as much and you can't be as as just open as what you should be so um, fashion for me has always been something that I 
no person could ever trap me with. I was I was not a prisoner of somebody else's thoughts. I, I could do whatever it was that I wanted to do with fashion, and that's what I will continue to do. So as we move on, guys, I just challenge you, um, tell me, leave a comment, share. Let me know what you think is, is fashionable. Let me know what you think is trending. And it's this is not meant for... Uh, us to tear each other down. This is just meant for us to get to know each other and us to kind of get to see the differences that we have and kind of celebrate that because I, I applaud you for being different. It's something that you shouldn't be ashamed of. So um, you guys comment, share below, tell me what you think. Let me know what you think is trending. I'm actually going to be picking a couple of trends that I like and I will be posting so you guys uh, stay blessed and make sure you guys stay out of trouble. I'll catch you next time. Bye.